Hello everyone. Welcome to the fourth episode of Screener Screenshots. Recently we have added a new feature where one can write us your thoughts in the notebook. Ayush and Pratyush, could you please help us understand the significance of this new feature? Thanks Kaushik. Yeah Kaushik, we recently added this feature for notes on the website. A lot of you requested for this feature that where we can just record our thoughts like why we are liking this company or just write small thoughts on a company and that's where we created this feature uh, the main idea behind creating this feature was like we just didn't want to add a feature of writing the notes we thought how we can do it much better uh, so lots of us think that we will write lots of notes and lots of things but sometimes it is very hard to put everything into into thoughts and writing down all the thoughts that's where we also added a feature for recording our feelings quickly like we can just click and hold and record our feeling about a particular company that i am very bullish of this about this company today and the longer we hold it it gives more value to that emotion one can just possibly also have a contrary thought on the same day as well like you are feeling bullish about a company as well as bearish about a company on the same day so like this you can just give that feeling some quantitative measure these things can be more useful later on maybe where we can allow users to sort on these feelings and other things so this was one of the ideas like to be able to record our feelings quickly at the same time we have built on a good editor where you can drag and drop images any attachments pdf zip files anything you want you can drag them and drop them into the editor and those will be saved in your personal notebook for each company and third thing is like we try to add some automation around how we can allow users to create notes without even typing anything so it will automatically record few actions for example when did you add the company to your core watch list or any other watch list or when did you remove them from your watch list and it will show a, a delta since then like what happened since you were positive or wrote something on that company on that particular date so like this we hope that this notebook feature will be very useful in revisiting your thoughts after a year after two years after three years from now and you will be able to make much more sense re think retrospectively into what you were thinking this also shows up on the watch list so once we go on to our watch list it will show this notebook icon against next to all the companies that we have in the watch list and again it should be it might we hope that it is helpful like we can click on the company name and it will show us all those uh, all those time journey uh, yeah like that we hope it comes useful to people Uh, anything from your side bhai so personally for me it is very useful i feel that this feature can make lot of sense because i keep adding lots of companies to watch list so at any point i might be tracking over maybe 4 500 companies and you don't even remember why you added something so i believe at the time of adding this stock to watch list i would like to put down a small note as to why i added it to my watch list it may be just that somebody told me about this stock he told me two three things about a stock so i'll just note it down over there and that will be like a starting point for me in future or the other use case generally is that once we land upon a company name we do quick search around that company we go to the website we go through financials and there are so many thoughts that come to our mind at that time so if you can get into the habit of noting down those positive negatives observations about that company that will be like a small diary that that is accessible to me each time i am looking at this company again for me i think these are several patterns that are there in your mind but there are so many multiple thoughts that you have on each company positive negative if you can capture them then you have more clarity in future when you re- retrospect as to what you were thinking and did it play out or not accordingly so i hope it works out for everyone thank you